Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Brad and this is Battle for Azeroth. I'm on currently on my Horde Hunter, my Hunter Sentry, and uh, the Warfront finally opened. This is the first time the Warfront's been open for the Horde side. It started on the Alliance side, so this time we get to experience everything as it happens. So I'm going to join the queue and see what happens. The queue might take a while, so if it does, then I'll just uh, cut that part out. Oh, looks like we're going to go right in. So let's go. So I've been told this queue is open for two hours. I could be wrong. I think it might be open the entire six days if you haven't done it. But when I tried to access it on the Alliance side, I wasn't able to queue. So I have to read up more on it because I'm not quite sure how it works yet. A lot of people are having that problem, apparently. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We've got the Reclaim Argor, Argor Rock, and we have to claim iron and wood. And here's the map right here. So basically, it kind of reminds me a bit, a little bit like a MOBA. There's like a upper, a, a top lane, a bottom lane, a middle lane, and then we have to take the base. That's our ultimate objective: is to kill the leader of the alliance side and it's a uh, one of i think it's one of three different leaders it's random each time but uh right now we're on an airship behind our future base and uh it's full of alliance troops so basically our first objective is to parachute in off our ship and we will uh take back our base first then we have to take the lumber camp and the mine and we have to collect resources for both. And because this is my first time going through it, I'm going to get quests from the NPCs in our base. And then everyone's going to be participating to build the base up to a fortress. But while we're doing that, we also have to fend off Alliance NPC uh, uh, rushes that are going to be coming at us. That's funny. This I decided to just fall off Warrior instead of jump off, and it looked like I was going to hit the ground, and then Today it popped me back up in the air. Our axes, for the blood of our okay, so there are... So, so basically, they took, our base ba they took our base from us, just from a story perspective, and we're taking it back. Whoa. Whoa. This guy can call air bombardments. So I will be doing videos on this in the future, but it won't be like the tutorial mission. It's basically like a tutorial mission when you're in here. Different NPCs from different buildings will give you a quest, a basic quest to do. And it's kind of teaching you a little bit how to play. Uh, basically in the sense of collecting resources and how to spend them. There is joy in victory. I just thought this would be more of an ongoing thing all week, but I'm not sure how that works. I guess somebody's already doing that. There we go. From God, rightful home of the troll banes? Get out of my sight, Greenskin. Greenskin! Oh, oh. There we now go. You made me mad. We need resources to hold them off. Spread out and bring me some iron and lumber. Okay, so we gotta spread out. I'm gonna head to it looks like a lot of people are heading to lumber, so I'm gonna go to the mine instead. Uh, I like to try to balance it out, so I look at all the dots on the map, and if I see a lot of... There's a lot of dots going to the lumber mill. And also killing these guys will... I don't know why... Um, I don't know why there are rogues here sapping these guys. It's like killing them gives you resources. <laughs> Like, I just looted that one guy outside, and it gives you resources. You get iron from the enemies, too. So it's good to kill the enemies and mine the, mine the trolleys. 
what do you call them? The mining, those mining buckets? Mining cars. Overseer Chris. This must be the boss. have taken well we're about to take it somebody else is grabbing the flag magic bridge is ours we can use its lumber mill to help build our base okay so they caught the lumber mill already well done with dry whisker mine under our control we will never want for iron okay so not only do we take this we have to we have to defend it as well so the uh, Alliance will send NPCs down the roads towards the mine. And we're going to catch po capture points further ahead to kind of buffer that. But um, if we don't watch what we're doing, they can end up taking the mine back. And then we have to take it back from them. And yeah, it's a big circle thing. Oh, this guy's got a quest. You impudent what worms you? have no right to be here. <laughs> Looks like it's Dennis Trollbling. While the mine is under horde banners, our peons ensure the iron supply never runs dry. This key provides access to the chest. Make sure it still works. Okay. So he gave me a key to a chest. Oh, the chest is back in the base. So it's the main chest where I gather resources. So I guess it just helps me personally. Alright, so let's get out of here. I've got 112 iron. Deeper into the mine where I just was, uh, enemies will still spawn. And you can stay here and keep attacking them and keep gathering iron. But it's we more efficient to... Now train those grunts. It's more efficient to go back and check the chest and uh, give your iron back to the base in order to build the base up. Alright, so I'm going to hand in my iron. We'll get to the front after I've done these quests because I want to get these out of the way in this one so you can see basically everything that's involved. There is a quest system behind all this. Speak, friend. Uh, greetings. Our recruits are eager to join you on the battlefield. Speak with Throck to recruit an ally from the Sick. barracks. Throw hall. Okay, I can do grunts, axe throwers, I can't afford shamans. Uh, let's do grunts. Strength. Oh, they actually follow me around. Cool. The altar of Wait. Has been completed. Where's my pet? Oh, so I get a couple of grunts, and I have my pet as well. That's pretty cool. May your blades never dull. All right, so he gave me... Where's the chest? There it is. Strength and honor. Oh, cool. So the rewards for doing these quests are also resources. That's pretty good. Uh, they don't seem to have a quest to go to the lumber, but I'm going to go there anyway. The armory is complete. Get those forges oh. up and running. Another quest just popped in the base. And there's a quest over by the lumber mill. Let's see what he wants. Speak quickly. Uh, let's contribute. Actually, let's contribute a whole bunch. Goodbye. Those are all the resources I had for iron. Oh, there's another quest that just popped up. Well fought. With North Blood and Thunder, we can focus on whole. bigger targets. Okay, see what the armory has to offer. Aw, oh, crap. I already spent my iron. <laughs> uh, I can go back and grab more, I suppose. Or maybe it'll give me some here. 26 iron. What's new? What? Old drum call too busy for you? I'm not surprised. At least now the armory's up and running. We can work on getting our allies better gear. 
Looks like the construction of the Altar of Storms is complete. I'm sure Meredith uh, would be more than happy to show you that what mysteries, what mysterious powers lie within. Watch yourself out there. Okay, so. Hello. Let's see what she has to say. Oh, it gives me a buff. Oh, no, that's cool. Oh, yeah. I don't. Oh, it goes up to four times. I need a bit more resources to make it four stacks. Okay. So let's go to the mine now. If there's no more quests in here. Okay, there doesn't appear to be more quests. Let's go over to the lumber mill. Looks like we've already taken the three initial points. So there's, you may not be able to see it if you're on mobile, but if you're on desktop, there's these little lion icons that are moving around on the south side of the map right here. Those are the attack waves with a boss. So they're the ones that are the dangerous wave. Luktar. Thomka, Th Thromka sentry. I'm always looking for someone who thinks they can swing an axe with the best of them. If you can remove the sapling without much trouble, I'm sure we can find a be the best use for your skills. Go forth to victory. Okay, let's move a bit further out. Oh, I see. Those trees look different than the usual trees, but I gotta do this one, I guess. Oh my god, that's not much in the way of lumber. What do you need? Be safe. Okay, let me get some lumber under my because I only got ten lumber, so let's see how many of these give me. Gives me seventeen? Not bad. Oh, Oh, wow, there's lots of trees back here. I hope the dogs are hungry. With horde banners flying over Newstead, we can now train wolf riders. I don't think I can carry Our more than two guys with me. Stronghold. Oh, I'm capped at 100, so I have to go back to base anyway. So it tells us when an assault force has been deployed by the Alliance. Uh, where is that big guy going to go? Okay, let's put some... Already put a bunch in there. There we go, I've got my four stacks. It only lasts 10 minutes though. Not many people are contributing to this. I'm not allowed to contribute too much, apparently. Oh, I've got to do a mix of iron and lumber. Okay, so now that we're done those... Whoa, this guy is really close. What the... He should not be in here. He got all the way to our base gate. I can't believe he actually got all the way to our base. Nobody stopped him. Wow. How did he get all the way to us? No one's on the bottom lane. What is everybody doing? That's odd. Oh crap. Not good. The 
Stuff is ready. Build some demolishers and show the Alliance how easily its walls crumble. All right. No one's over here trying to take this. Very odd. I figured there'd be more tanks in here, but apparently not. Whoa. Come on, come on, come on. Gotta watch the map, too. Basically, if we leave this tower here, They'll keep moving forces in through this tower, so we've got to purge them of this. Whoa. Big guy's angry. Whatever that was, I did not want to know. <laughs> okay. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so now that we've got that side... Oh, it looks like the other side's being attacked now. to grab more resources from the keep, I suppose. How are we still not... Hmm. We gotta keep building our base up. We can't just uh, let it sit here like this. Another quest just popped. Where is he? Or her. Oh, there. Hey, how you, doing? you must be the new guy around here. My name's Margie, or Margie. And that over there, that's Pixie. We run a tight crew here at the workshop. So if you ever need anything, you know where to find us. Now I suggest you head on over to check in with Pixie and show you what we have to offer. Oh, oh. Only three demolishers can be active at a time. Purchase a demolisher, a powerful vehicle capable of dealing siege damage, able to destroy enemy structures and gates. Okay, so Keep I don't real. have enough iron. Let's, uh, I forgot I have to go back and talk to her to complete the quest. All right. Well, what is that? We all got a buff. My perch belongs to the horde, or should I say, the green skin. Okay, let's head out. Everybody's making a push for the final the point outside You'll of Stronghard. Knees, just like the rest. I like this guy. He's cool. Okay, so we just caught this point. And now we're starting to make a push forward. Okay, this is where it gets dangerous, because now we're going to be hit by artillery. Yes. Upgrade! Oh, 
his cavalry knock you down. Whoa. Little gnome mech trying to sneak through our lines. Cami cause cog whistle. <laughs> I see that siege engine trying to sneak by. Great, now we got artillery and the siege engine hitting us. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, drop mines. Oh, we can actually attack the siege tower. Percent, five percent, one percent. Okay, so that's one siege tower off our back. Circle of Elements has been lost. Oh crap, nobody's watching. Okay. Nobody's watching the uh, bottom lane again. It seems like everybody just wants to rush to get to the boss, but not actually defend. in combat. I have no pet out. <laughs> I was just out of combat. Now I'm back in combat. Take down that gate. Let's show that troll bane fool what a few green skins can do. Okay, let's get over there. God still stands, orc. I'll enjoy watching your corpse float in my moot. Defenders, show them the strength of our city. <laughs> Oh crap. Oh crap. Way too many. Okay, so it looks like no one is defending the bottom lane, which means our our uh, point, our warp, well, I guess waypoint outside our base is about to be overtaken by several bosses and a whole contingent of infantry and mages and everything and just no one's there to help. Seems like now there's some people there to try to stop them, but... Okay, everything's leveled up. And they're literally just outside our gate. They're right here. Okay, now the problem is, oh, why am I in combat again? Okay, I'm going to leave them to go after that tower since I already took it once before. <laughs> I'm going to head to the main gate if I don't get dismounted by all these spiders. Don't dismount me. Oh, there's an elemental up. Oh, it's on our side. Nice. A thundering Goliath. 
Oh yeah, so they send troops out from Stromgard to try to stop us from breaching the gate. So basically the troops are going to go after our siege engines for sure. So we've just got to guard the siege engines. Okay, it looks like they're being held off. Okay, so we killed the main guys, and they've closed the gate on us. Oh, the gate is, uh, the gate has timed out the, the actual... That's funny. Yeah, we definitely gotta get rid of these guys. Basically, we're all gonna all want to rush into the fortress, but just there's a boss there, but we still have to deal with. Oh crap! Of course, there's a mage behind me. They're gonna keep sending troops out to stop us. And that guy who's up front there obviously doesn't realize that he went in by himself. So here we go. Wait, there's a boss back behind us. Why is nobody fighting this guy? Enforcements. Okay. Now we should be clear. There's a couple of Alliance siege engines on the right side, but we should be able to kill the boss before they can stop us. Okay, this guy is dangerous. Okay, the siege engines on the top lane were destroyed, so they're gone. Wow, what is this guy? He's not a hunter. Oh, he's using uh, his troops to uh, help him out. I really wish they would make uh, Stormwind. Stormwind's walls and buildings look like these. They're so cool. Whoa. hitting him with everything we have, but he's got a shield that pops up occasionally. <laughs> Whoa! Get away from me! <laughs> You're crazy! Can't even see him. There's so many horde players and peons all around him just attacking him. Three, two, 
One. Yes. Oh, cool. I got a 340 back. It's got haste and versatility, though. Meh. Okay, so let's see what he has to say. Speak, friend. Battle well fought. Oh, I get another cash as well. A 370 piece of gear. Uh, once again, you've proven yourself a great warrior of the Horde. Go forth to victory. Oh, nice. So I got a back piece, which was 340. Or, yeah, I got a back piece, which was 340. Oh, it's so small. And I got gloves, which are 370. Oh, those are a big upgrade. They look cool, too. Okay, and it looks like we've completed that aspect of it. I suppose when we finish with the actual assault on Stormguard with all the queues, I don't know when the queues finish, uh, then we'll get access to Arathi itself and we'll have quests to do in the zone. But that'll be in the next video. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Did you like this video? Then hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video.